Stretch of road in Little Italy has some people confused. A portion was made a one way street years ago to ease truck traffic, but was never changed back. Three News Now reporter Max Charlton has more. Yeah, that's right. And what's driving you crazy? Pierce Street, which was one a two way street, has been a one way street for a few years. But one nearby resident I spoke to is wondering why it's not getting switched back. From my experience in the 72 years that I've lived here, we have never, when I say never, have noticed a single problem. He's talking about Pierce Street between 6th and 8th Streets, which is now a one-way street and has been since 2012. It just causes such an inconvenience for so many people living down here, and Pierce Street was made for a through street. A through street, which according to other nearby neighbors, had been an issue. It was done because we had constant complaints about truck traffic up and down that area. Speed was also a problem. We went out years ago, we studied it, we talked to the residents, we put the one way in place. Speed bumps were later added and a public meeting was also held to get the input of residents about making that a two way street again. But residents with concerns were not present. But we said if you can get enough petitions from the people that live along the street to change it back, we'll change it back. The signatures Vendetti received wasn't quite 75% of the people living on that stretch. He also feels this is a bigger issue than just for people living on Pierce, but around the neighborhood as well. If they would have asked the people who lived here, they would have they would have had many, many objections over the one way street. Making it a two way street again, according to the city, will bring back the trucks that have been absent from the neighborhood. It's not a, a designated truck route, but if you make it two way without constant carrier enforcement down there, the, it's a shorter route for the trucks. So they do it. And Pierce Street for now and for the foreseeable future will remain a one way street. Public Works telling me residents along that stretch are telling that company, the Public Works, to not change it back. Let me know what's driving you crazy at Max Reports on Facebook and at Max Tarleton on Twitter. In the studio, Max Tarleton, 3 News Now, live at midday.